guys, welcome back to my channel and to another Dyson Era tutorial. In today's video, I am going to be showing you how to create gorgeous, beautiful, sleek, poker street hair using the Dyson Era. I know that there's a lot of controversy around whether or not you can get super straight hair with the Dyson Era. As someone with pretty thick, difficult to manage hair, if I can get my hair poker straight with the Dyson Era, you can as well. So let's just get straight into it. Guys, I have finally released my Dyson Era course. This is an A to Z course to teach you how to use your Dyson Era to its fullest potential. If you were like me, and you feel like you've wasted your money, certain attachments that you never go near because you feel like they don't work for your hair, don't know the correct techniques, you don't know what products to use, you don't know any amazing little hair hacks that's gonna help you style your hair really quickly. If you're any of those things, then this course is for you. So guys, the first thing we are gonna do is prepare our hair with pre-styling products because we know how important pre-styling products are regardless of what tool you're using. The first thing we're gonna do is apply my Philip Kingsley 5-in-1 Elastic Styler Treatment. If you watch my videos, you're probably sick to death of um, hearing and seeing me applying this, but it is just really good. It smells amazing and it has loads of different benefits to your hair. Because my hair is quite difficult to manage, this just makes it a little bit easier to manage. It helps with frizz, it helps with moisture and hydration. This also really helps get all the knots out of my hair because I don't know about you, but after I get out of the shower from washing my hair, it is just so knotted. Next thing I am going to add is some heat defense. And this is also like a leave-in conditioner. So I'm just gonna spray this all over my hair. You wanna make sure you like lift your hair up so it gets into like the different sections and it's not just all in one section of hair. And guys, that is about it for this. Sometimes the best thing to do is really simplify the amount of products you use in your hair because it can be very overwhelming. There is lots of other products I really enjoy for different benefits. Like I have a really good split in remedy that I use from Philip Kingsley. I have a really good root volumizer if I want lots of volume in my roots. There's lots of different ones that I enjoy, but sometimes I just like to use the essentials to keep it simple for you guys because like I said, I know that it can be overwhelming. So let's get this bad boy out and let's put it to good use. Okay, so you're obviously going to put on the dryer attachment because we want to get our hair about, usually for a straight look, I get my hair about 70% dry, but you want to just really make sure that you have the roots good and dry. So I'm just going to give those a quick blast before we go in with the smoothing brushes. So let's go. Now guys, there we go. Again, as you can see, this is what we're working with here. So like I said, if by the end of this video, I can show you how Poker Street I can get my hair with the Dyson Air app, then you can do it too. Because I mean, look, <laughs> look at this. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna give my hair a little bit of a brush. This is Hagrid out in full force. Like if I wanted to dress up as Hagrid for Halloween, I wouldn't even need a wig. Like this is, nailed it, nailed it. We are gonna start by sectioning our hair. And listen guys, you can try and do this without sectioning your hair, but I guarantee you, especially if you have as much hair as I do, you ain't getting it straight. Like you need to section it, it's gonna make it so much more easier to manage and it's just gonna do a better job at straightening out your hair. Okay, so I'm gonna spray more heat defense on it because that's also gonna help just dampen it a little bit and again, protect it against the heat. Give it another little brush because you wanna make sure that there's no knots in it whenever you're running the smoothing brush through it. So guys, you have two different smoothing brushes and depending on your hair type, we'll decide what smoothing brush you're gonna use. I actually have a video on my channel that I'm gonna try and link up here. If it doesn't come up up here, it'll be linked in the description to fully explain to you the difference between the smoothing brushes and what one to use. And um, based on my hair type, I am gonna be using the firm smoothing brush. So that is the one with all the little bubbles. I am going to put my settings at high heat, high speed, 
and I'm going to talk you through this as I am doing it. So you're going to start at the root and you're going to slowly work your way down the hair, okay? So start at the root all the way down and you want to go slowly. You don't want to be doing this. No, we want to be doing this slowly. And also, you know what guys, I'm gonna turn this off a wee second, okay? So this is what I see girls on TikTok and Instagram do. We have naturally straight hair, and so they do this, and they have this beautiful straight hair. And then we have lots of people out there, like you and I maybe watching this video, who have hair like this, that doesn't just straighten with literally a click of the finger and is naturally fly away and gorgeous. We can't get away with doing that. That does nothing. You wanna get the hair, and you wanna place the brush under the hair. Not like this. It is not going to straighten your hair, okay? Let's go. Guys, can we just take like a little moment to appreciate this? Like, hello. Who needs the Dyson Hair Straight? whenever you can do this with the Dyson Hair app, okay? So guys, as we said, we wanna piece the brush under our hair. We're gonna start at the root and slowly work your way down the hair. Always creating as much tension as you can as you go. Tension really is a massive part of the key here. You wanna be creating as much tension as possible to get this nice and straight. That is the straightening complete. Now, I used to have quite long bangs, so it would work really well, like, you know, having my hair like pulled on and like looking really sleek, and I'd have it like, you know, just looking proper, like poker straight, like this. As you can see, look how straight it is. I was like, like I said, because of my bangs, I just don't really think that looks right, so. I personally always like style my bangs so that it's a bit more like this. So I've got straight hair, but like my bangs are like wispy, like back into my hair. So now we are gonna add some hair oil, just a little travel size because I wanted to test it. And that's actually such a good idea. If you ever wanna try out a new product, like look on different websites to see do they have like little travel sizes so that you can test it to see whether you like it and want to buy a big size, especially like if it's quite expensive, because that Moroccan oil is, is quite expensive. Right, so rub it into your hands and then rub it through your hair. It's just gonna help smooth it out, make it look even more straighter, get rid of some of your frizz if you've still got a little bit of frizz. So guys, this is kind of a part one to a part two video because I am gonna release another video a few days after this one um, to show you how I get my hair even straighter and even smoother flyaway frizz free using the new flyaway attachment. But I'm aware that there's still quite a lot of you over here that don't have this attachment, so I just wanted to make this video. I know that everyone who has an air app will of course have the smoothing brushes, but not everyone has the flyaway attachment because this came with the new Dyson Era. I will make sure I add it to the link in the description and I will try and add it to pop up here in the video. So go watch that and I will show you how to finish off this look 
getting it super smooth, adding lots of shine and getting rid of all the flyaways. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you enjoy creating your beautiful, super sleek poker street hair using the Dyson Airwrap smoothing brushes. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.